Welcome back, folks. We have Matt <laughs> Dayton here joining us from uh, Slifer, Smith, and Frampton. Thank you for joining me, Matt. It's Thanks good to meet you me. this morning. Yeah, um, well. So for people who don't know, they're unaware of the real estate market and what's going on up here uh, in Summit County. Can you just give a quick introduction for Slifer, Smith and Frampton and maybe how you got involved, what you do there? Yeah, well I grew up in Breckenridge, um, so this is my hometown. Local, yeah, yes. my hometown <laughs> and uh, Summit County is my backyard, so I uh, couldn't get back here quick enough. So mm -hmm. uh, love it here, but um, yeah, Slifer, Smith and Frampton, great uh, real estate company. We've got about 50 brokers with our company, so mm -hmm. it's a it's a sizable company. We can deliver a lot. Um, you know, we work with properties from everything from yeah. partials, ownership, all the way up to luxury, six million dollar plus properties as well. Yeah, I believe you said you have four. There is four offices, right? Yes. So there is Vail, Keystone. So mm -hmm. what, what are the other? Offices? We have two in well Summit County. We have two in Frisco on Main mm -hmm. Street. We have two in Breckenridge. Um, on Main Street as well, mm -hmm. and then one in the heart of Keystone, uh, okay. right in River Run there. Okay, so really an ideal real estate agency for the Rocky Mountain yeah, region. Yeah, we cover it and... all really well. Okay, and yeah. I believe, and so yeah, so you're local, mm -hmm. or you're, you're native local, right? Yeah. So do you feel like that gives an advantage to your clients as far as that are buying or selling? You know, this is, it's like riding a bike young. I mean, this is yeah. my, this is where I live. This is my hometown. This is everything I know. Um, you know, I got, had a chance to travel and explore on the US ski team, you know, go all over the world, come back here. This is where I love. Uh, I can't think of any other place to be, but yeah. know it like the back of my hand. Yeah. So, awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, so what is the what is the market right now? Like what's the state? Is it a buyer's market or a seller's market? What can you tell us about the yeah, market? Yeah. So uh, given our inventory right now, it is more of a seller's market. Okay. Um, there are uh, not as many properties as we'd like to see, so mm -hmm. we're, we're, you know, certainly would like to see that inventory come up. Um, but our buyers are really savvy, so you know you have to price your property appropriately um, with the comps. Um, you know we are seeing overpriced properties sit on the market longer, so it's important to stay within those comps. But um, I would say, yeah, it's leaning more towards this, towards the seller right now. Okay, awesome. And you must have a great understanding of the local market, I mean, being here for so long. Yeah, right? no, definitely. Definitely know the, the area of the market well, um, and a lot of research, just keeping up on it all the time. Okay, and I understand you have a property to showcase this morning, I so, do. right? I do. I so love So what is that property? Maybe you have some pictures of that, I believe? Yeah, yeah. So this one is, um, it's 1819, or 1817 Falcon. Um, mm -hmm. It backs up to uh, the golf course in Eagle's Nest. Nice, but you nice. walk through this house and you can see and you've got that view of buffalo Those right through the back it's just gorgeous windows. huge timber super, frames yeah i am super big on windows and light coming through we had so. to just keep rescheduling the the shots because we wanted to get those in the background because it was cloudy and snowy every day but well, um, good good work good yeah work. yeah so uh <laughs> but you know just every every inch of this home is just meticulously cared for um, gorgeous views. You've got those gorgeous timbers, logs. It's really attention to detail. This is just focused on the quality. And these guys, they just take immaculate care of their home, um, yeah. just with the upkeep, you know, going through it every year and making sure that everything's really taken care of. Um, it's about uh, just under 5,500 square feet. It's got a nice, large three-car garage. Oh, um, nice. definitely needed. Yeah, you definitely, definitely want to have the, the, the three-car garage. Um, main floor master, you know, virtually, you know, very few stairs getting up to that main floor, and then you got that main floor master. Um, bedrooms all have great views. So you've got, you know, this one's like kind of this turret that sits up and you get those views of Baldy from that bedroom. That's nice. Yeah, There's not a, not a bad bedroom in the, the no, house. You've got no. great views all throughout. It is. I it, love all the wood too. Yeah, just a lot of really nice touches. And you know, it's, there's, there's construction and then there's luxury construction. And this mm -hmm. is luxury construction for sure. Um, you know, you've got your, you've got your nice um, tiles, you've got your nice cabinetry. Um, you know, Italian tiles in that in the wet bar downstairs. 
Outdoor living space is awesome. That's what I would love about this house. You've got this fire pit out back. You got the hot tub. You sit out there. It's quiet. You've got nobody behind you, and you've got those unobstructed views just going out towards yeah, Buffalo, that is, which is really cool. That is gorgeous. Yeah. Now, how many bedrooms, how many baths is this? I'm not sure. I can't remember if you mentioned that already. No, nope, so or not. it's a five bedroom, six bath. Oh, nice. So, you know, it's, nice. It's, it's, really it's a nice. large house, but it's cozy. Like, you don't feel mm -hmm. like you're going into this big, giant house. You really, it's got intimate spaces. Um, you can, you know, that the, it, it doesn't feel like a, a mega mansion or anything like that. Awesome. That's yeah. great. So, so if someone's interested in this property or maybe seeing some of your other mm -hmm. properties, what is the best way for them to get a hold of you? Yeah. So, um, you can go to my website, which is play-homes.com. Mm -hmm. Awesome way to search properties. You can get on there and just really, uh, see everything in Summit County. Um, you can set up searches. You don't have to sign up for anything, so it's really cool. Um, so if you don't want me contacting you, you don't have to. Mm -hmm. um, but you can also look at sold. So that's one of the unique things about our website. So, um, or you can give me a call at, at the number on the screen there, 970-485-1167. Okay. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Matt, for joining. Thank you, And thank Kia. you for sharing and showcasing just such a beautiful home that's on the market. I hope, you know, if you're looking for a vacation home or a new home up here, definitely check it out because that looks like a nice find. Yeah, no, it's so. gorgeous. I'm super excited about it. All right. <laughs>